hope you guys had an amazing new year and that it was safe. I know this year was definitely a bit different for most of us, but you know, we do what we have to do to hopefully have a great and amazing 2021. Speaking of New Year's, a lot of us like to make New Year's resolutions. I know I'm not one who always makes a New Year's resolution or sticks to it, um, but this year I have a goal uh, that I definitely want to complete, at least for the semester. Um, so you may or may not know, I might have talked about it, but my fall semester, I was pretty happy with the outcome. Um, Grades-wise, I had all A's and B's, which is something to normally be happy about. Um, but I was a straight-A student in, like, middle school, high school, I was a straight-A student, so I really didn't know how much B's affected my GPA, and I looked at it, and I was like, whoa. <laughs> uh, so my goal this semester is to find a good college balance, and what I mean by that is to find the balance between academics, athletics, and all of my outside commitments from school, like from scouts and everything along those lines. I want to find that balance to be able to do all of those things, but also still have a good social life. Because if I'm not having fun in college, then that's going to put a damper on my experience. So I want to make sure I find that good, healthy, hearty balance with all of those things combined. So that's my New Year's resolution, um, or at least my resolution for the semester. And you guys can also let me know your resolutions by responding. So as you guys can tell, my New Year's resolution has to deal with school. And speaking of that, as you can tell, I'm still at home, but I am very, very, very excited to get back on campus. Fall semester was something that I couldn't have imagined it to be. And I'm very excited to be back with my teammates, to be back with my friends, and to get back on a normal schedule. Being at home is great, and of course I'll miss it, but I'm very excited to get back to like a structure and classes, though they might be stressful and I might regret saying this, I'm very excited to get back to a schedule with classes and practice and get back to some kind of normality, um, as best as we can, of course, during the pandemic and the year of 2020 and 2021. Um, but that is basically all I have for you guys. Uh, to remind you guys, we have two things coming up that I want to remind you guys about. First, we have the fan cutout campaign. You can find more about this in the description of the video, but it has to do with getting a cardboard cutout of your face or somebody else's face made um, that will be going up in our stadiums for the basketball game so that the basketball team has fans cheering them on, though we can't have people there in person. And we also uh, have coming up the Day of Giving, which is February 14th and 15th. Right now, we are looking for advocates. There will be an email in, the, in my bio to this video where you can find more information about that. If you want to look, you can also look on last year's uh, Day of Giving part of our website, and you'll find a lot of information there. And of course, when more information comes out, it can also be found on the Marietta website. But that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you have a great rest of your month, and you can get started with your New Year's resolutions. And I will see you guys next month.